Hello, my name is Max, and I am doing a cultural assignment on Popol Vu, um, and I'm just here to talk about it. Um, so, the Popol Vu is, you know, it is a text um, similar to the Bible uh, for the Mayan people. Um, it's an extremely early text, um, uh, and it, it, to kind of get an understanding of what it really is, um, you kind of kind of break down the words. So, Popol means maths. Um, the minds uh, were really uh, advanced in mathematics and you know the sciences, and they kind of get an uh, understanding of the sciences, uh, just like uh, other civilizations like the Greeks and stuff. Um, they used uh, mythology um, and and wrote different stories and tales of their own creation of and and of you know what they believed how the world worked in this book, um, and I believe you know. To kind of understand the world around themselves, they they use this, um, and if you if you think about it, only the priests and nobles could read this. So, you know, the only people who are writing this are also the priests and nobles. So you can really think this is a book for the people to be who who are under um, a, like a higher class to kind of understand this and uh, have a deep understanding of what the people is, which is. Basically, they're just Bible, you know, uh, what they should be um, understanding, you know, the way they were made, their religion, everything, what they need to be, uh, like their guidelines, everything. Um, it, it's, just, it's just a book with many stories and tales, similar to the Bible, uh, but for the Mayan people. So the story I, uh, you know, found the most interesting and I, I read was, um, it was the very first story of their uh, like the Mayans creation in the Popol Vuh and it really details about um, it starts with um, the origins of um, basically nothingness uh, there's there's nothing in this um, you know reality at the start until um, a few uh, wise entities uh, these gods um, come together um, th this is a polytheist uh, polytheistic society um, people and they, you know, they believe in more than one god. So these gods come together and they speak about um, what what they want to make, what they want to create, you know. And they eventually do create um, the light, the darkness, all of that um, together by speaking, conversating, uh, deliberating, and and shaping uh, creation: the earth, the water, um, the dawn, everything. And you know, they didn't believe in. The reason humanity was made was because they didn't believe glory or grandeur could exist until human beings were made. So that's why they formed humanity. Um, they really wanted to be praised. They wanted to be wanted. And they wanted a, a people to live under them. And, and that's why these gods made them. And the story really details um, how uh, the minds believed that, uh, their own reality was made. Um, obviously now, you know, thousands of years in the future, we... we have a lot deeper understanding past mythological tales, but in this day, this is um, what they summed it up to. Um, overall, like the, the text was pretty easy to understand. It was, it, it was completely clear. Um, surprisingly, um, you know, the English translation of this is, is extremely detailed, extremely good, and um, I could, I really could understand this, like just easily, just like reading any other book, um, and. It, it really wasn't that complex. Um, the stories were very uh, streamlined and, and they're just very clear. Um, I, you know, I, to answer the last question, um, is this text relevant? I do think this text is relevant as um, I think historical understanding of one of the first civilizations um, on Earth, the Mayans, um, shows the history of all of us and understanding that you know, how they believed what they believed, the science and maths that they understood, knowing how we evolved from that um, to where we are now is just really, really, um, really, really important to me. And I think um, knowing now where people come from and, and, and how, how far we've come along from um, having to use, like, text such as the Popol Vuh to understand the world around us to now, you know, measuring so many, like different, you know, different sciences and stuff. It's really important. Thank you.